Hey there, everyone. It's Thackard, and welcome back to more Horizon Zero Dawn, the Frozen Wilds. Now, today, we were picking up where we left off last time. And uh, last time, we just did a whole bunch of, I would say, busy work. We got all of our pigments, we got all of our animal statues, and we got all of the blue gleam we could find. So, um, I went and I purchased another uh, outfit <clears throat> with a blue one. I think I have one more left to purchase. But, I'm going to go and uh, drop off the two animal statues that we picked up. And then we're going to continue on with the main mission. Yeah, let's load in everything. There we go. All right, we're going to fast travel up here towards the... Here it is. The visitor center for uh, Yellow Sun. And we will... Uh, toss these two last statuettes... Their little holographic display pedestals. Care to talk about these figurines you of yours? They're not really mine, but I've always got time to talk about them. There you go, Enjuk. That should be the last of the figurines. It is. Grab those. I guess I already bought them. I just haven't opened them. Ooh, light. I didn't know if I'd ever see the whole collection reunited. <sighs> and look at them. They're beautiful. You've done a great thing, Aloy. Ah, a buffalo. These may represent the last record that any of these beasts ever lived. Take this. It's the least I can do. And come back any time. I and our animal friends await your return. That's well. all I need to know. Are you sure? You can never learn too much. So... Canis Lupus, the enigmatic gray wolf. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. Could it be that these wolves and our foxes are the same somehow? Close. Perhaps after hundreds of winters. No. No, that's ridiculous. Close. Uh, I, I love bison. Buffalo. Bison, Green. bison, bison. That's the actual Latin name of the regal American bison. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. Latin? Perhaps that's some sort of old world custom in which one repeats the name of a particularly <laughs> revered animal. Yes, exactly. Latin, Latin, Latin. Bison, bison, bison. Right. Fast travel. So we completed all of those, which is great. And we have the story mission to go. So I don't know. How much more we have left to, to do? I don't know what all is in this expansion. I've quite enjoyed exploring this area. We'll grab our charger friend. There's a road right here. Yep. So we're headed to Long Notch. We are going to go to the... Is it the Drumhead? What do they call this thing again? Hmm. Something like that. Thunder Drum? Is that what it was? Not quick enough. We are going to Just gored each other. Uh oh. 
control power. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> uh, that wasn't funny. That hurt. Alright, um... Well, we might as well wear this outfit because... That shorts out the shields that I normally wear. One more should do it. I'm assuming there are some stalkers over here. Because I see the mines that they normally drop. I'm not seeing any stalkers. Plus, maybe there's one up here. Yep, there it is. That was indeed a stalker. Of them. I can get you know out of this. I think they are weak to Oh no, but these are the corrupted versions, aren't they? Alright, you know what? Best bet? Blow them the hell up. They're running. Doesn't even know it's on him. Boom. Stalkers at. Ooh, ooh. Poor guy. They both ran this direction. It's funny that they don't put down footprints. Stalkers, where are you at? Hang on, there he is. Oh, 
He's already he's already angry. <laughs> oh no, the explosion took me out. He, he freaking suicide bombed me. Uh, unfortunate. Oh, we got a long way to go to get back over there. I guess I should have put that uh, one outfit back on once I got rid of the thing. It's like the GPS, man. It's like, make a U-turn. In 30 feet, make a U-turn. I wish you would just say, turn around, dummy. Definitely stuns all these guys. Like, completely up. Using proximity ones. They're healing because of the thing. Shoot. I forgot they're still healing because of the thing. I forgot they're still healing. the uh, stalker over there. Okay. You're worried about the other guy right now. How did I forget to shut down this thing first? <laughs> it's like step one, shut down the healing tower. Next time we will uh, use the right bombs too. I can't make any more. Probably should save these for something else.
There he is. Oh, I missed on that one. Okay. I think that's everything. stuff on them. No room. no room. There's always room for purple mods. Are you kidding me? Always room for purple mods. All right. Come here. Give me your loot. Thank you. I'm sorry, friend. You shall be missed and replaced with a simple, simple whist, uh, whistle. Hang on. What do we got up here? Hang on a second. We have a new. Wow, we have a couple new missions. Wonderful. Do we have new stuff? I already got these. And I already, or I don't have that one yet, but it's 18. Okay. Um, I guess we talk to, what? Let's talk to the boss first. Talk to Araya, talk to Ara our attack. Long notch is well stocked. As you asked. And our scouts are watching for more frost outlanders. Our He's numbers rise. In the Three more hunters and have passed their tribes. Tell your friends how tough you are. Silence you or have you banished. But our purpose was to take back the mountain. Now what? Stay prepared. Sharpen your spears. Should we not return, defending the cut falls to you. If our chieftain agrees with this course. Sounds like good advice, but let's hope it doesn't come to that. Chieftain? The weight of command is no small burden. I can see that. Okay. I take it you haven't spoken to Araya yet? Why should I? This is what she wanted, to return to Thunder's Drum. It is her only care. So I should have known she would find a way to push aside my spear. After the Karja took my sister, not all of her came back. Interesting. What happened to Alea <clears throat> when she was a captive of the Karja? As a shaman, she's adept with machines, tracking them, stunning them. The Karja used her to capture them for the Sunring, where they were unleashed upon the innocent. They made her part of their blood sport. <clears throat> the shame she suffered beneath their pitiless sun. She survived. She endured. Endured by reminding herself of the spirit, her purpose. And now that's all she has. All right. Tell me what happened to the first expedition. Rhea led the way to the summit. But it was blocked by a great door. Some kind of cauldron. Ooh. New metal. I can get into that. We tried to break through, but it was unflinching. We were exhausted. No way forward and machines behind. I made the call to push back. It cost us greatly. 
But to remain would have cost us everything. I had hoped to never subject Array to that again. Well, that's what, what we're going to find out, right? That door? I do not know. That expanse of metal, that dead hum. Nothing sacred belongs there. Machines and death, that's what the mountain holds. Death for us or for the daemon. And if we do find the spirit? Then perhaps we should put it out of its misery. Type of AI for of some what sort. it's worth, I'm glad you're coming with me. Hmm. Someone has to keep Araya safe. So, machines in the south suffer their own sort of corruption. Okay. We'll get caught up on this mission and then we'll go grab these other two. Is this the cauldron? I guess so. Oh, Neltuk. I wish you luck on the mountain. Eloy, this is it. My chance to reunite with the spirit and perhaps to reunite her with the blue light. It's not a chance I would have had alone. I needed an outsider. Someone ignorant of our ways, but no, not ignorant. I. Are you trying to thank me, Araya? Yes, of course. That's what you do. Untangle knots. Create possibilities. Thank you for making this pilgrimage possible. I only wish it had not been necessary to humiliate Aratok. You were wise to let him come. He's earned the right. Stubborn as stone, but he's had to be. The war demanded it. And so have I. Okay. Uh, we'll read stuff, and then we'll ascend. Aratok told me you were a captive of the Karja for a long time. It sounded bad. For Aratok, it all comes back to that. He thinks the Karja changed me. They did not. They merely sharpened my focus. When all else is lost, you think about what's truly important. The spirit. The blue light. The beyond. And my brother, too. Every time I felt the chill northern wind, I thought of him. Worried for him. What did the war do to Aratok? He cut away everything until only his mm. true self remained. Unyielding ice. No Banuk has more sheer will. He fought the Karja for a thousand freezing nights, yet always rallied his hunters at sunrise. It is said he endured 23 wounds in those years. His hunters mm. counted them. He never wow. complains of one. Instead, he complains that life with me is harder. <laughs> That's right. What have I ever given him but struggle? Silence. Now that I'm chieftain of the Werak, I don't suppose I can order you to tell me about silence? Aratok would never have presumed to grasp for a secret of the Conclave. But you are not Aratok, and if you have dealt with silence, your need is well apparent. Silence came to Bon Or from the distant north, the young shaman of the Owl's Watch, a remote Werak that rarely comes south to parley. Silence was a shaman. It was. Or at <clears throat> least, when we sent runners to ask the Owl's Watch, they said he was. His knowledge of the machines was beyond compare, and he was hungry to trade what he knew to the rest of us. It didn't take him long to gain the trust of the Conclave, and eventually, an invitation to attend. What about you? Did you trust him? No. But he impressed me. He carried himself with poise and authority. I wanted to learn from him, but 
That was not to be. He was granted knowledge of our most sacred meeting place, the frozen caves of the Malmström, a month's march from Banur. He met with us there, as is custom at high winter. But when we next returned, the caves had been looted. Relics of the old world stolen. Holes cut in ice and metal. Yeah, that'd be Silence, all right. He vanished <laughs> with the spoils. We sent our best trackers after him. None returned. And when we checked back with the Owl's Watch, those who had vouched for him were gone. As though he never existed. Some in the Conclave began to doubt he was even Banuk to begin with. And what do you mm. think? He committed an unforgivable sacrilege. He's unscrupulous and dangerous. But also brilliant, skilled, and knowledgeable without equal. Except, perhaps, for you. Anyone else I would warn off. But you may be able to treat with him safely. Just don't lower your guard. I'll keep that in mind, Horea. Thanks. Okay. What are we gonna find up there, Rhea? Ruins. Machines. And a door. Like that of a cauldron. I have faith that you can find a way through it, Aloy. Been there, done that. The spirit. I know I can find her there. Though I do not doubt the daemon has tried to hide the way. The fact that it gives me a comeback and I go forward take care of a few things. Understood. makes me think it's like one of the here. end things. So we're going to go and take care of these other missions down here first. But the story that they're developing here is actually really good. Really well done. I wonder if uh, Aratak as chieftain had to do as much busy work as we do. You're Aloy, right? I am. My pop, Burgund, I mean, told me you might be heading up to see me. Varja, pleasure. Hey, that spear is really something. You've customized her, haven't you? I've made a change or two. You've got an eye for weapons. I wish these Banuk agreed with you. I can't seem to sell scrap to a Glentalk around here. Everyone wants boring old bows and spears. I like the more unusual stuff. And mm -hmm. the Banu can get unusual. Like that spear Aratok hauls around? An ice rail. Ooh, or that weapon of Araya's? What I wouldn't give to poke around inside one of those. Feel the lightning on my fingers. Or inside of anything, really. Last commission I had was a month ago. A weapon that spat fire. That didn't go well. <laughs> Um, I've got all three. I've got a nice rail, just like our talks. You want to take a look? Uh, are you serious? Y yes, yes, I'd love that. Okay. Mm. <laughs> Obvious design flaw. So if I replace these, yeah, that should... <sighs> right, so believe it or not, she's operating at... Let's be generous. Half her potential. What the Oh. Pop says all weapons are girls. I don't think he realizes it's a compliment. Uh, well, listen. If we had a Thunderjaw's mandibles to work with, her gears <laughs> would be well and truly greased. And I know where to find one. If you want to go hunting with me. All right. So... Let's say someone you know happened to have a weapon like Araya's. You don't. See for yourself. Of course. Look yep. at the... So the coils generate the spark, but the power source isn't even bolted in. I won't lie. She's beautiful. But there's beautiful and then there's beautiful. <laughs> what we need is a Stormbird Talon. Lightning flows over them like water off a goose. Yeah, And I know, I know. where one is. Hunt it with me. I'll turn that weapon into your new best friend. Second best. 
It's been a while since I've gone after a stormbird. A weapon that spits flame, huh? Like this one? I took this thing off an Osaron bandit. Think you could do anything with it? <laughs> you got my forge fire back? Well, if you took down Olgrid and his goons for this thing... Nice. I guess she's yours now. Why don't you finish it for me first? Make it... Make her. Into the weapon she was supposed to be. Thought you'd never ask. I'm gonna need a bellowback snout. Any bellowbacks will do. Can you handle it alone? I think I can manage that. All right, let's do this. This forge fire of yours, what do you need to finish it up? Like I said, a bellowback snout ought to do it. I'm not picky. You're sure you can fix up this thing? You bet. Probably. Just need Stormbird that Stormbird Talon. Talon. Remind me what we need to fix up this thing? That Thunderjaw's mandibles will do it. So we need parts from a Stormbird and a Thunderjaw? And you know where to find them. That's right. It's gonna take some traveling, though. We can find a Thunderjaw out in the Valley Meet, and a Stormbird roost near the Free Heap. I'll pack and meet you out there. This will be fun. Okay. Okay. Uh, how far out are those? Are those back in the, uh... Yes, they are. <laughs> I was wondering if those were back out in uh, the Sundom. Yes. So if this is the Stormbird we're going after, is the Thunderjaw the one that's up here? Isn't there one that's like right around? That's the other Stormbird. Emoth Convoy. All right. So where is the... So the thunder draws this one over here. Okay. All right. Well, I've killed these guys before. And then any type of bellow back. Okay. Let's see what this other one has for us to do. Oh, save. That way we can Outland. best... Travel. It would be my honor to speak with you. Okie dokie, speak with me. Each of the many verses of your song tells of an impossible victory. That is true. The notes echo across the cut. You shouldn't believe everything you hear. Hmm. Uh. My song used to echo around Banur. Omnok, the hunter of legendary machines. That's why I'm here. For another. They call it the claws beneath, or they did when I was younger. Oh no! This defeat would have given my song a fine end. Oh, yeah. The the burrowing days. I used to travel between Banur and the Cut without stopping to sleep. But this trip, my bones ache, Huntress. But you, out hunting Aratak, leading your own Werak. If half your song is true, you are the only hunter I trust to go in my place. You want me to hunt for you? Not just for me, no. For an old friend. Okay. You want me to hunt in your place? Is that some kind of Banuka custom? Well, perhaps it should be, but no. <laughs> we survive and we prevail until we fail to do either. I confess. This is not easy for me. For any other machine, I would die as I have lived. A Banuk hunter, weapon raised. But too many good lives have been lost to the claws. Throwing my old corpse atop the pile accomplishes nothing. Better to live in a world without the claws than to die while it still makes children orphans. Okay. Sounds like you've got a reputation. To be Banuk is to push your body to its limits. I found my limits higher than most. Fearsome machines needed killing, and in my youth, I found I had a talent for killing them. Even now, my name carries such weight that when the claws beneath re-emerged, the Werak came to me. Do you still have the same faith in yourself that your Werak seems to have? Perhaps I did. Before I held my bow in shaking hands. 
Noticed for the first time the spots on my knuckles. What a strange thing it is to be old. Huh. To stare backward and see such distance. But to stare forward at a looming wall. This machine, the claws beneath. Why travel all the way to the cut just to hunt it? Some songs. They include a refrain. The return of a past moment. It seemed fitting. You've hunted this thing before. Must have been 20 winters past. We were so close to bringing the claws to bay. Closer than anyone else ever got. We? Me. And my friend. He was a chieftain of my Warak then. A skilled hunter. Brother? Every few years the claws would emerge in a new location. I knew of two chieftains he'd sent to their burial fires. My friend became the third. This hunt. I had hoped to complete it in his honor. Yeah, let's do it. This is obviously important to you, Umnak. Are you sure you want someone else to take down this machine? Uh, I am no longer a match for the claws beneath. If I ever was. If I face it, it will kill me. Of this I have no doubt. The Banuk blood in my veins screams at me to take on the claws myself. But I must see it brought down. <clears throat> and dead men see precious little. All right, Umnak. I'll do what I can. I've no doubt you can do quite a lot. The stories say the claws beneath returns here only once every six winters. All right. The whispers I've heard say it now makes its home on the northeast edge of the cut. Hunt well. Okay. Claws beneath. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. That's that is definitely the thing that throws the rocks at you and is buried underneath. Yeah. That, that looks like the same arena that was over here at the, uh, it's like, uh, there was a, there it is. The quarry. Yep. Yep. And there are also a couple of them that live out here. Whatever they're called. They're called the, uh, then they there's one that was like out this direction can't remember the name of them that's it the rock breakers I bet you it's a giant rock breaker we'll call it an icebreaker all right so let's plan out our stuff here we're not gonna do the main story right away because I'm assuming that's gonna take us into like the end of stuff uh there are a couple things we can do we can go after the different Stormbird, Thunderjaw, Bellowback. We can go and get the Rockbreaker. And we also have one more mission up here at the Hunting Ground. Now that the, we're the Chieftain, we should be able to do it. So I think that's what we are going to be planning out. Um, let's see if we can knock this hunt, uh, this Rockbreaker out real quick. Like, Ooh. Um... All right, I'm going to make a quick trip down for more ammunition. And then we'll head back up towards that one campfire. See you guys in just a minute. Okay, so I have bought some supplies. And I have arrived at this area here. First and foremost, foremost, we will have to take out that healing tower. Otherwise, we will just get completely shredded. Oh, jeez. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty certain that's what there you it are. is. There it is. Just like Umnak said. should be enough. I don't 
but I know how to stop it. Okay, how did we take this guy out last time? Alright, I think we... It's been a while since I've taken one of these guys out. I think I want to go with... I'm going to tear blast the hell out of this guy. And then we're going to... Do some blast wires. Okay, that just spooked the hell out of me. No, oh, no, that's the wrong button completely. Move, move, move. Run. You're exploding underground. Okay. Ah! I'm invisible. Oh, oh, phew. Oh, jump. I missed. Missed again. No, you're not starting this off very well, dude. Uh oh, it saw me. I can't corrupt this one. Last time I fought a couple of these guys, I corrupted one of them. Oh no, this one's not going to care about that. I think I was right. I think I want to start laying down blast, blast lines. That's not what I wanted to use. Hang on, hang on. Uh, the thing's down. We need to get our shield suit on. I cruise through two of them. Oh, that's not good. Oh, it just it gets, goes right through the two of them.
Ugh. All right, let's go back and read the text for this guy. Rock breaker. Digging arms. Exhaust ports on his back. That does more damage. Fuel sack. Okay. And in general, these guys have... Stuns hostile enemies. And your strength is shock and corruption. So it's not like we can... Alright. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, first things first, put on this outfit. Knock out the tower first. Jeez. All right. We're in full golden mode right now. Can't make any more. Run, run, Ayla. Run, Ayla, run, heal. that one. Oh, no. Oh, I was doing so good and I blew myself up when I blew up his uh, fuel. Okay. Damn. Well, we got his number now, though. We got his number, guys. We got his number. We know exactly what we need to do. That's not what I wanted to use, that is. Ah! 
Ouch. That hurt. Oh, I didn't get the heal off in time. Damn. Thing hits so hard. Missed. Okay. Let's knock off some sh shield and curse. Now let's start spreading the damage. Oh, 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 ow, 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 ow. Overheal, overheal. Olay!
Run! Run! Run, Aloy! Run! He's just gonna keep exploding! wasn't lying when he said you were tough. Oh, yes. Okay. Give me your loot. That was a great fight. Oh man, that was a great fight. Tough, hard, super difficult, long. Old remedy. Took a couple of times to do it. But great. All right. Next time we will be going and we will be doing some uh, uh, the Thunderjaw, the Stormbird, and the Bellowback. So see you guys next time. I'm going to spend a little more time looting all the stuff that's around here. If you enjoyed or disliked this video, I do hope you comment on it and give it a thumbs up or down. If you want to see new videos, please hit the subscribe button, and to be notified of new content when it comes out, hit the notification bell. But for now, thanks for watching. Have yourself a great day, and don't forget to bring it no matter what you do. And I will see you guys in the next video.